No, my boy some Lila. No, my boy some Lila. The mountain mover. Good morning again and I'm Shanjeng from Sibegis Logo City. God has a provision for your vision. Wonku Mundo Zelwe, Wonku Mundo Pilem Slabeni, God deposited something in him and in her. God installed and preloaded you with a vision. But most people, they don't understand their vision, they don't understand why they are living. Wonku Mundo Opilayo, Enginayo, a vision in life. Wonku Mundo Opilayo, Enginayo, a dream in life. He's living in in tragedy is living in a mess because they just wake up every day abazi ukuthi baphililane abazi ukuthi bazalelweni wonke umuntu umaye bakhona emhlabeni uNkulunkulu umdaleli intethi because when you come emhlabeni awuzi nge accident but you come because there is a vision and there is into uNkulunkulu akakudalela yona little by little when god created adam and eve he started by creating umhlaba he created ihlahla he created umhlaba yonke into semhlabeni and then was Say ever dala or edem no ever. Now, Bandabaning, they don't understand that God has already provided them is into Abazoiding. That is why when we read the book of Ephesians chapter 1, verse 3, praise be to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us in the heavenly realms with every spiritual blessing in Christ. In other words, everything that you will need has been already provided for you or work we have to understand your vision you have to understand why you are living you have to understand what is your purpose in life many people like abangama christus especially they misunderstanding about your vision and commission and the mission my vision is to win souls for the kingdom of God. But my vision is to heal people. That is not your vision. That is the commission that Christ gave out to his disciples in the book of Matthew 28 verse 19. The Bible says, Therefore go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, and teaching them to obey everything I have commanded you, and surely I am with you always to the very end of the age. That is the commission that Jesus Christ gave it to us. Wonkumutu must do that, but that is not our vision. Your vision is unique. If vision yako cannot be same thing as vision yam, wonkumutu uzalwe nge vision, uzalwe nge vision, eya shugi. That is why shugi le si unique. That is why we cannot replace you. That is why you are irreplaceable because you have your own unique vision. That is why little by Bailey in the book of Jeremiah chapter 1 verse 5 I knew you before I formed you in your mother's womb and at Toba he gave you a unique vision to fulfill isn't a till M7 you have your own purpose man to buy a Sabbath to expose their vision because Abbas would who will provide for their vision but Abbas would how are they going to fulfill those vision but I want to assure you that when you read the book of John chapter 19 verse 30 it says when he had received the drink Jesus said it is finished with that he bowed his head and gave up his spirit on that very moment Jesus was saying it is finished in a vision yako every provision that you will need I'm saying ECNZ Yonkindo that you will need it was stand on the cross Jesus Christ died on your behalf so that Yonkindo Zoidino Ibe corner and Uma struggles you for everything. Your vision has a provision. You don't have to worry. Just trust the Lord in everything because your vision has a provision and your vision is unique and your vision is powerful. Obako, just stand up and realize good why are you living? Because when you're living without a reason, you are just waiting your precious time. Understand why are you existing? Understand good why are you here? Many people are working hard but they are not satisfied because they are just working without a vision. Many people even if Bezama would be motivated they are not motivated because they are living without a vision. If you live without a vision, even if you can have money but you won't be happy and you won't have joy because you are living without a vision. No man able to drive a big car, you have big qualification, you have master's degree, you have a good paying job but you will never have joy if you don't have a vision a vision keeps you in times of difficulties a vision keeps
helps you when you are down a vision motivates you when you have no one to motivate you a vision keeps you going even if you don't see because you have a bigger picture because a vision shows you something that you will become tomorrow a vision inspires you to work hard because you know what you will become tomorrow and a vision equals with umai bon uilendo yona nam sanja but it wends a ui bon uilendo also by yona xasa and a vision helps you to you don't just do anything anyhow but when this into according to your vision you are unique and you have a unique vision and god has provided everything for your vision understand why are you existing understand the purpose for living by that you will fulfill your vision and you will be happy and you will have joy understand why are you living god has a provision for your vision god bless you